Good morning or good afternoon, should I say. It's Victoria from GBP Estates, just outside this property, a semi-detached three bedroom house in Romford, central Romford Park, Gideon Park as well. It's just off Rafles Park Road, if you know where that is. Um, now, I just want to talk to you a little bit more about the property as I usually do. Um, so here we have access straight through to the garden. Um, obviously it is a driveway as well as you can see, but you can easily fit kind of two cars on this driveway, which is great. And there also is permit parking down here as well. So if you can see permit parking, now that there you're kind of in the central Romford but it is a dead end road so I wouldn't worry too much about that um now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take you in so I'll show you a bit a little more outside the property okay double glazed windows throughout as well guys on this so let's walk you through so you can see you have a lovely porch way here for shoes coats whatever you wanted for this Okay, so I'll just show you there first. Right. Okay, let's go through. So I'm going to take you upstairs first. <laughs> Don't mind the cat. <laughs> Doesn't come with a house. There is a kitten around here somewhere that you may see. Okay, so here we have quite a large landing area. Go straight through to the galley kitchen, which I'll talk you through in a minute. Okay, if you don't mind, I'm just gonna shut the door really quickly. Okay, okay, so we're gonna go upstairs first. So as you can see, the stairs are not too steep, which is great. And you also have here. A nice little kind of gallery window. Okay. So let's go into the bathroom first. Okay. So in here, I do believe there is storage, shampoo, conditioner, towels, little utility cupboard as you will. Got a little towel rail there. Okay. Lovely bit of floor space area as well in here. And this is the landing. Got the loft just right above me. It is fully, um, no it's not. It is insulated, it's not fully bolted. Now in here, this is the second bedroom. So excuse all the boxes and things, as you, um, obviously if you are interested in the property, the vendor is moving, so she is packing up. Okay, it's got a lovely bay window there, gives you a little bit of extra space. I should shut the door so I can show you the real size of the room. Okay, so all of this storage here is great because it's done for you and it really will minimize the storage like the mess and maximize kind of the space and what you could do with it the ceilings in here are actually quite high as well which is also good i will kind of show you the view as well from the garden as you can see down there they do have a conservatory as well so you can see it's, the garden is completely not overlooked at all, which is so nice at the back. It's, it's a big trees and forestation, which is great. 
So as you can see, right. Okay, let's take you through again into the master. So again, these property lights in a lot of natural light as well. There's no, absolutely no um, lights on in this property at the moment. Now this is the master. Okay, so again with the bay windows, really lets off that light. I'll show you the view from outside as well. Let's see this way. Can. Right, okay, it's all netted. <laughs> Two seconds. So here we are. So it's actually a really quiet road if I'm perfect. Yeah. So if you're so close to Romford, you would never think it. The houses down here are all so lovely. Okay. Big open space, double bed there, and still so much floor space that you can work with. So let's take you through into the second bedroom. The second bedroom in itself is actually really big as well. Again, with the bay window, but just now it's got the little wall, so you can have like a little bit of like perfumes, laptops. So single bed in here already. Again, with the nice high ceilings, I actually should have probably showed you from this window, really. <laughs> so again, with the uh, little bit of space. Now, this could be great for, like I said, nursery, a single bedroom, an office, a dressing room. But it's a really great size. Now, if I take you down, say, we'll go through to the kitchen, into the garden. You can see kind of the size of the hallway, which is good. Okay, so let's take you through the kitchen. I thought I'd just let you know, kind of in here, you have your electric meters, your RCD fuse box as well. So you have all of that in there. I like about this, they have separate doors on them as well. So it kind of separates the property if you want to. Now this is the kitchen. Most of you might say due to the size of this particular property, the kitchen might be a bit too small, but what they've done is they've actually extended to the conservatory. So I would suggest, and the vendors suggest this, is knocking this wall down, and making it a big open plan. Keep obviously the wall here, for that bit of separation for the hallway, which sometimes people quite like in these type of houses. But with this, I would knock it down and probably make it a big open plan for social events and things. But we have the boiler here, which is a valent boiler in perfect working condition and great size for this property as a combi as well. And they do also have just this little cupboard here bit of extra space. Okay, so there's a dishwasher in here and two fridges. So there is plumbing work, which is great. For all sorts. And then this is a very, very, very big um, conservatory. I believe this is a three, three meter extension. Actually, no, I think it's a six to be fair. I really do. Anyway, I would have to definitely check that out for you guys. So you can just see kind of the size of it is huge. Let's in a lot of light and it really is actually quite warm in here as well. Okay, so again, like I said, if you knock that wall through, you'd make it a massive social aspect. This is tiled floor as well, which is great. The garden, oh, here's the kitten, as you can see him. <laughs> so this is the lovely garden so it's got all new fence panels I 
And I believe the shared driveway that they do have, you could, if you wanted to, bring your car in. That is an option. But again, if you can hear it, you can't really hear at all that you're in the mid you are at probably about a three minute drive in central Romford. Not even that, one minute, two minutes. The garden is so well maintained. It is beautiful that they've kept it so nice out here. So you can just see the little flower beds over here, which is so lovely. Got a little space out here as well. So look at that, that's all in your garden. It's so lovely. So that's the property. I'm going to walk you through into the lounge dining area now. So you can see this group of barbecues, family parties. It would be so lovely. Now, again, like I said, they are boxing stuff up. This has been a family home for many, many years. So there's a lot of memories, a lot of storage. So you see it with an open mind. So this here. is the dining area along with the walkthrough lounge so can you see now this wall take it out and make it a big open plan obviously you have a builder to come in and to have a look at that for you we've got a fireplace down there along with a little bit of storage you walk through into the lounge again with the high ceilings you've got the door walk through there big bay windows this flooring is all new as well pretty well new so that's the property overall guys if you are interested please do give me a call on 01 708-50-4455. Again, that's 01-708-50-4455. And um, we are open to offers very quickly. I will be doing block viewings as I usually do. Please let me know and I'm more than happy to help you. Thank you for watching.